Where am I, Jose Monkey? You asked me to figure out where this video was recorded, so I did. Hi, I'm Jose Monkey, and I find people who ask to be found. This video is very, very short. In fact, I had to loop it just to give myself enough time to do the intro. Fortunately, it was also pretty easy to find. So what can we see? Let's just watch the whole thing again. It's only three seconds. Where am I, Jose Monkey? Bet you can't find Okay, so the first thing I did was flip the video horizontally so it wouldn't be reversed. One of the first things we can see is what looks like a fast food place here. And I was thinking it was probably an Arby's because this looks like their hat-shaped sign, which is pretty distinctive. We can see some other stores in the distance here, but I couldn't really read what any of them were. Then we see this building, which looks very much like a bank to me. I'll come back to that in a moment. Person keeps turning the camera and we can see this building that has colorful awnings here. And I also noted these three rather large trees. The camera then turns back the other way and shows us all those same things again. Okay, so I was able to figure out that what I thought was a bank says D.L. Evans on the side, which is in fact a bank. And that helps quite a lot here. According to their website, D.L. Evans has about 40 different branches in Idaho and Northern Utah. And lucky for me, they have one of those location pages on their site that shows all of their locations with a photo all on one page. It occurs to me, by the way, that I have no idea why a regular person would ever use a page like that. Like, who wants to scan through the list of all stores or banks or whatever just looking at the photos of every single one? Like, you probably want the one that's closest to you. But anyway, I'm not going to complain because it makes things a lot easier for me. So I looked through the list of locations and compared the photos to what I saw in the video. And I quickly ruled out several that didn't look right at all. And I paused on a few which looked like they might be right to check to see if they were. Eventually, I saw this one. This looks very much like what we see in the video, though I suspect it's taken from the other side of the building if it's the correct one because it doesn't look exactly the same. So I went to the Google Street View to check it out. And the bank is not there. Google Street View just shows us a big empty patch of grass. So that photo was from 2019, so I figured this is probably just a relatively new branch. I crossed my fingers and started looking around to see if I could confirm the other details from the video. And I'm happy to report that this was, in fact, the right place. You were standing here in this parking lot near the D.L. Evans Bank in Rexburg, Idaho. Even without the bank, I was able to use the Google Street View to confirm the details. I was able to see the Arby's that's at the start of the video. I got a better look at those stores across the street and discovered that they were mostly places I had never freaking heard of. And I could see that building with the colorful awnings and those large trees. It's a Del Taco. Based on what we can see of the parking spaces and the lampposts in the video, I think that you were standing approximately here when you recorded your video. That's only about 200 feet away from this Albertsons store that's right here. And I'm guessing that's where you work. Isn't that right, Karen? Guys, check out the map on my site to see all the places I've found for you so far from the videos that you've tagged me in. And while you're there, maybe go check out my store if you want to pick up a shirt or something. And if anybody else would like me to find them, record a video where you say, find me, Jose Monkey, or something like that, on camera, or hold up a sign that says something similar. And don't forget to tag me in a comment on that video.